Heart and Soul Park at 825 North Rosemary Avenue, across the street from the Sunset Lounge, has some beautiful creative new additions. A museum without walls, the park's art pieces include 20 mosaics inspired by vintage jazz posters and record covers that tell the story of the historic Northwest neighborhood's rich history. They also pay tribute to the neighborhood's community trailblazers and the jazz icons who played at the Sunset Lounge. Public art identifies the city, you know, and in this case, the, the historic Northwest neighborhood, what it identifies with the public art is this um, rich cultural history that um, isn't well known yet, but soon will be because this is a museum without walls. The city's administrator of public art and culture says Dominican-born South Florida artist Avoca Juan used an online questionnaire to gather feedback from the community as well as holding public meetings and conducting research to help paint today's portrait of the past. They also went and did research at the Historical Society in Palm Beach, and they also went to the African American Historical Society of Palm Beach County, and they gathered all the research in order to make sure who played at the Sunset Lounge during its heyday, but also who were like the trailblazers, the, you know, the cultural icons of the historic Northwest neighborhood. Among the stars depicted in the mosaics, Ella Fitzgerald, Ray Charles, Nat King Cole, Louis Armstrong, Count Basie, and James Brown, all of whom played at the Sunset Lounge from the 1930s through the 70s, as well as Dennis and Thelma Starks, the original owners of the venue. Other prominent locals who are honored with mosaics include Dr. Alice Mickens, a pioneer in black education, her foster daughter, Dr. Alice Moore, also an educator, and architect Hazel Augustus. Visitors strolling through the grounds can find out more about the subjects of the artwork by holding their cell phone cameras up to QR codes placed on each piece and being directed to the city's website. The QR codes nowadays play a really important role in giving further information so that you can make your own guided tour. The mosaics also complement the park's open spaces and music-themed playground. The art project came to be through the combined efforts of the Community Redevelopment Agency, Sibile Welter, the city's Art Life WPB committee, and Art Life WPB's Percent for Art program. Through that program, developers are required to either spend 1% of their project's value on public art that's placed on their property but within public view, or donate that money to the city for future public art installations. So far, over 50 art pieces worth several million dollars total have been placed around the city through the Art Life WPB program, including those at Heart and Soul Park, with further additions expected as West Palm Beach grows. For more information on the city's public art and Art Life WPB program, visit wpb.org artlife. This is Cheryl Kahn reporting for WPB-TV.